Petition is granted. Motion. The end of Brian Banks' ordeal was marked by tears after a judge threw out the rape charge that had sent him to prison for more than five years. My only dream in the world was to just be free and to have the same opportunity as everybody here. He was a 16-year-old star linebacker with a full-ride scholarship to USC and had dreamed to play in the NFL when in 2002, a classmate accused Banks of raping her in the stairwell of their Long Beach High School. Although Banks insisted it was consensual and there was no sex, he told KCBS TV that his defense attorney at the time gave him a choice, plead no contest to rape or risk a trial that could send him to prison for life. When you go into that courtroom, the jury is gonna see a big black teenager and you're automatically gonna be assumed guilty. Those are her exact words. He took the deal, went to prison, and had to register as a sex offender. He thought that was the end of it. But after he was released, came a surprise. A friend request on Facebook from his accuser, Juanetta Gibson. I remember closing the laptop just like real quick and just like, like thinking like, what did I just see? So Banks arranged a meeting with a private investigator who videotaped the whole thing. Gibson later explained she hadn't wanted to say that publicly for fear of losing a $1.5 million settlement that her family had gotten after suing the school district. I may not ever get the answers as to why I was supposed to go through what I went through, but I know that I'm here today and I remain unbroken. Unbroken and working to get his life back on track. Those dreams of playing in the NFL, he says, might be realized yet. Lee Cowan, CBS News, Los Angeles.